Alright, hi guys and welcome back. I'm going to do another video this week. Uh, I'm going to cover Willy Wonka Funko Pops. So, originally I just started off with this set, which we'll get into this. This was just Willy Wonka and the Oompa Loompa. Showing the side of them. And uh, I like that they did the old version of Willy Wonka. So, here he is, and he does have his little cane there. Um, came across, where did I buy Willy Wonka at? Came across him, I believe, at Barnes and Noble. And, uh, couldn't pass them up. And at first I thought it was just these two, which was Willy and the Oompa Loompa. Um, and, uh, they did a really good job on the, on these two. And then, shortly after they released... Willie and the Oompa Loompa there. Hold them kind of back so you can see them there. Um, they did end up releasing everybody else, and we will get into that set here really soon. Um, is I don't know if a lot of people know, but uh, they also released a golden ticket set out of these. Now the downfall that the golden ticket is it's five kids: Charlie, Baruka, Mike, Violet, and Augusta. Um, they released a golden ticket set, and literally there was five golden ticket sets in the world. If you do find the golden Willy and golden Oompa Loompa with the golden ticket in the box, it is more than likely a fake. Um, I actually thought about getting it just to kind of have one, but I would want the real deal. Um, but since I already showed you Willy and the Oompa Loompa, we're going to get into Charlie, Grandpa Joe, Broca Soul. My TV, Violet Beauregard, which so happens to be my favorite one, and we'll get into why here in a second. And then Augustus Gloop. Alright, so we're going to start off with Charlie Bucket. He's holding, kind of getting a little closer. He is holding the golden ticket. And, uh, really good paint job on him. Um, the golden ticket does have all the words on it, and you can clearly read it, which I don't know if you can do it through the box, but really, really well done pop. I bought, if I'm not mistaken, I bought all of them except for Violet and Baruka Soul at Barnes & Noble, and I spent roughly about $9, well, roughly $10 after tax to get them. So there's Charlie. I got him set on the floor in front of me here, guys, so just bear with me. All right, then we got... Grandpa Joe, and he's got the fizzy lifting drink, if you guys remember that from the movie. And, uh, I think I kind of showed that. Holding the fizzy lifting drink. And there is his pop. There's the little fizzy lifting drink, and it even says, um, fizzy lifting drink right on the bottle there. And it also says it on the pop itself. I thought... Like I said, this set was just really cute, and I couldn't pass up the whole set. Um, who are we moving on after Grandpa Joe here? We got Veruca Soul, which was my favorite. She was my favorite kid out of the, the spoiled brat. I kind of I kind of like this character. Um, her box was extremely beat up. Um, this one I did pick up at Toys R Us. And I think I might end up getting another one because, like I said, the box is incredibly beat up. But there's... Baruch Assault. And she is holding the golden egg. Um, which was really cool. Like I said, one of my favorite characters out of the, uh, out of all the kids. And, um, I just wish the box would have been a little bit better. And the neat thing is, I don't know if you can really see it, but she's got freckles. I'd be able to show it better on this side. She's got freckles on her on her face and on the pop itself she actually I don't know if it's picking it up but she's actually got like the little freckles all over her face um this would happen to be one of my favorite pops right here this is Mike TV and uh that's his pop and this was a neat thing um 
they actually give you a miniature pop inside here of Mike TV when he shrunk himself. Um, the only thing I kind of, oh no, they do, they actually did. Um, I was going to say the only really cool thing that would have been cool, they would have had the cowboy hat, but it is actually, I don't know if you guys could see it, it is actually on his back. Um, because he did wear the cowboy hat. And he does have little revolvers and everything like that. And his, and his, um, gun holsters. Alright, this one was the pain in the butt to get. Alright, so we've covered, we've covered all these already. Wonka, the Oompa Loompa, Charlie, Grandpa Joe, Veruca, and Mike. Now we're going to get into her. Violet Beauregard. Um... This one was an extremely, extremely hard pop to find. She is a 2016 summer convention exclusive, so she was really hard. But there she is, guys. I did have to get her off of Amazon. Um, I bought her from a third party here in the States. And uh, she came really, really like packed like super good. Like, I can't complain at all about the shipping. But there she is. Swelled up like a blueberry. I love this pop. Like, I went through hell trying to get her, and I'm glad I got her. And then we're going to finish the set with Augustus Gloop. Um, you guys remember him? He was the gluttonous kid who just kept on eating and there he is got the little bite taken out of the the wonka bar there he's got the chocolate smeared all over his face i loved it uh, really really well done set if you guys don't have this set i do recommend highly getting the wonka set because it is uh literally an amazing set to get um i think next time we are going to cover Rocco's Modern Life, and then I'm going to move into a really big set, which is Smallville, and then I might cover my Superman Pops. So, uh, guys, don't forget to like and, like and subscribe to my channel. Once again, I am AJ, and I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Have a good one.